righty, Justin's going to let me teach a little sprite kit today for you guys. So, uh, first thing we're going to do is uh, open up uh, Xcode and uh, make a new, doesn't really matter, iOS, tvOS. When it comes to Sprite Kit and Swift, it's all about the same thing. So we're going to make a new game over here, and uh, we're just going to call this uh, casting, because that's really all we're going to be looking at today is just uh, casting casting one variable. Is that right? That's right. One variable for another. Okay, so uh, you're going to want to head over here to your game scene dot swift file and go ahead and just uh, excavate everything that is currently inside of that did move to view statement get uh, rid of everything that's inside of here and uh, so what we're gonna need to do is make a, a variable be somebody else and uh, we're gonna we're gonna pick on a, an SK label node so we're gonna go over here and this is gonna be ver var ver or var I guess and we'll just call this uh, Cleavon Cleavon label that is actually how you capitalize my, my first name without the cap. Just a cool lowercase c. All right, so that's uh, Cleavon label, and there's going to be an SK label node. I don't know if anybody even knows what that SK stands for. Some sort of crazy programming jargon. It's actually, it's a uh, sprite kit. Oh, that is it really? Okay, all right. So, uh, next thing that you're going to do, you're going to go over here to your game scene.sks file. And uh, we're going to just lay out a label, okay? Here it is. Just drop it down in here. That looks a little wimpy right now. Let's make it uh, maybe a nicer, cooler black color. There it is. And then um, go over to that little kind of junky arrow. Click on that guy. Click on it again if it doesn't work. And then hit uh, 48. Well, I don't know, 48. Make it bold. Everything's got to be bold. There it is. Everything should be bold, let's put it that way. And uh, try to get rid of that guy. Alright, so now what we want to do is we want to label this. I know, that's fine, that is a label, but we're going to give it a name. So it's going to be, I don't know, Cleavon, Cleavon name. There it is. And that's good enough for right now. So save it, go head back over here to your game scene.swift file. And we want to be able to adjust that label throughout any function that we write inside of this uh, project. Okay, so if we kind of just uh, were to put this variable inside of uh, this one particular function, it's only going to exist inside of that. All right. So what you're going to want to do now is uh, when you move to view, and that means that when uh, you know this thing first loads up, we are going to put in the uh, how do we do this again? Oh, it's an if statement. So, right, all right. If, let, yeah, let, uh, and then uh, we just give it any old uh, variable name right now. I know that kind of seems a little weird, but uh, let's call it Cleavon uh, uh, temp, temp name. How about that? Temp name, because we're just going to test, that's right, we're just going to test out whether or not this can be an SK label node. All right, so we're going to specify that this, that's the type of it, right? And then we're going to say uh, if and then self dot child node with name, right? And now we want to take that name that we gave it over here in the scene file, Cleavon name, right? So we throw that in there. Cle that was caps, right? Cle now I'm getting confused. Leave on name, yeah, I think that was caps. As all right, and you do that little funny question mark over here, kind of like, is it, is that what you mean? You know, you think that's gonna work? Cleave on name as SK label node, right? <clears throat> Pop that down there, and now here comes the tricky part. We're gonna we're gonna say that cleave on label actually equals. Well, maybe this should be temp label. Let's do that. Temp label. That makes more sense. So cleave on label is going to equal that temp label, the one that just got created only for thinking, only for basically answering this question of, is you a label, right? And then throughout the rest of this project, we can refer to uh, that label as cleave on label. We don't have to do anything with this now, right? So all we have to do is come down here to our touches began statement, and you'll notice I'm not getting any errors right here. Well, I am actually good. 
Oh, it's because I haven't written anything else. All right, text equals, and then, you know, uh, Cleavon from great from great state of Orlando, right? Florida. Stupid. There it is. Okay, so now you'll notice that it's when we load up the project, when we, you know, when we run it, build it, whatever, uh, it's just going to stay label. But when I press down, it's going to change to Cleveland from great state of Orlando, Florida. You know, it should be, probably be city, right? Okay. Uh, run it. Run it. Here we go. iPhone 6 plus that fancy one. And let's see what happened. I got to get my thinking pen in my mouth to chew on it. That's when I get real nervous. I got to... Ooh, it's a long time before. And thanks, Justin, for letting me teach this lesson. I didn't know when I saw your car that you didn't mean it literally when you said follow me. Right? So, yeah, you know, I just showed up, man. It's okay. It's just, I meant on, like, Twitter or Facebook, but... Well, you should... I mean, I take things literally, dude. Okay, so, uh, uh, I think it's, there it is, alright, so there's the label, and then click on down, look at that, uh, it getting cut off, but, I mean, that, such is life, right, things just get cut off in life. I mean, I, I lost a toe at a water park, you don't hear me crying about it, toe and a half, actually. I still count that half a toe as a full toe many times. If you ask me how many toes I got in my foot, I'm gonna say four, not three and a half. All right, so uh, the, one of the main things to remember here now is that uh, we have cast this as that child in the scene named Cleavon Name, all right? And you can think of that like uh, Shatner has been cast as um, uh, Captain Kirk, right? Or really maybe more to the point, uh, the Chris Pine version of uh, Captain Kirk is the same version as the Shatner version, right? I mean, canon-wise, that, that is the case. Cleveland, I think you're getting a little off track here. Why don't we just uh, shut it down? I think you have actually made your point here. Okay, all right. Well, thanks for uh, letting me stay the night, and uh, uh, I'll try not to, uh, you know, follow you again, good sir. <laughs> but uh, you're welcome for fixing the dryer, by the way, and mowing the lawn. Okay, well... I mean, I I didn't I did say thank you. I paid you a little bit of money for that. Oh, whatever, man. Hey, just you go back to your thing. I'm gonna go back to Orlando. All right, take her easy, dude.